this morning and yesterday we did a real live demonstration, so with a subject. So we recorded a subject during a procedure of uh, some aesthetic stimulation of the median nerve. We have recorded the brain activity related to this uh, stimulation, so we were able to show a visualization, online visualization of the data. After, we save the data in a FIF format, which is a usual format in MEG, which can be read by all open source software and licensed software. It was possible to display the brain response corresponding to the detection and processing of the sensorial stimuli, to present, to display some topo map of a magnetic field over the head surface, and to, to image the flip of a magnetic field across the time, showing that different brain areas are working sequentially uh, to detect and process this sensorial stimuli. So it's completely amazing because uh, we can follow in real time what what is happens, what is happening in uh, in in, in, uh, in the brain. And this uh, OPM system is very so flexible, flexible to attach to the head. In case of the squid EMEG, they cannot get the magnetic field directly. On the other hand, this OPM system is available to attach to the head directly. For example, so if the uh, scientists want to so measure the temporal lobe activities, so this is a big advantage so comparing with the current squid, the MAG. OPM will probably completely reshape MEG use because OPM are sensors that can be worn directly over the scar, so it's relatively close to EG, but with all the advantage of MEG and without uh, the technical constraints of current MEG system based on cryogenic sensors that require to be cooled at very... And so the sensors have to be kept relatively far away from the brain. And of course, if you can study the brain, it's better to be really closed to the brain. And so it, it, it's clearly a, a, a possibility uh, offered by OPM. And so it's why OPM is so interesting for MEG. What I like the most in, uh, in our company is that uh, we have the possibility to bring a new uh, brain imaging modality to, to, to more people. And uh, we have the possibility to, uh, to contribute to the democratization of this technology to help people to uh, have better tr treatments to uh, current uh, brain diseases, but uh, for which cares are not this efficient at the moment. And uh, we know it will take time. We have to find the right path uh, to develop the company on the right indication. It will be done little by little, but we are very happy to contribute to to this trend.